You know, Android gets a pretty bad rap for having a short battery life, but if you spend a few minutes with your phone settings, you can easily turn that around. Today, I'm showing you a few tips using the Nexus 5 running Android 4.4 KitKat, but if you have any phone running 4.1 and above, these tips will apply to you too. For starters, tone down that GPS. There are lots of ways it sucks up your battery life even when you're not using Google Maps. So head on over to your phone settings, then location, and choose location services from the bottom here. And you'll want to disable both location reporting and location history. Chances are you're probably not using them. And another tip for GPS, back in that location menu, head on over to mode and choose battery saving mode when you don't absolutely need pinpoint location reporting. This way your phone will use less resources to find out where you are. And here's another really good tip. You know Google Now? Okay Google, where is the nearest pizza place? You might not realize it's using a lot of your battery life. So head on over to the Google Now interface and scroll all the way up to this magic wand. Tap it, and from here, you can see what Google Now is showing you. You've got your sports teams, your stocks, your places. The ones that use the most battery life are, again, the ones that rely on GPS. So go down to everything else and disable all of the features that you really don't need, like traffic reporting and nearby places. If you don't use those features, you're just wasting battery life for absolutely no reason. And here's one that everyone should know, even you iOS and Windows phone users. Wi-Fi and brightness will always hog the lion's share of your battery life. Of course, you don't want to disable Wi-Fi, you still need to use it, but to soften the blow, head on over to your settings, and then to Wi-Fi, and here tap the menu button and go to Advanced. In this menu, disable scanning always available, so it's not looking for networks when you're not trying to connect to Wi-Fi. For brightness, make sure that auto is disabled and that you're adjusting your brightness manually to the lowest comfortable setting. You'll be surprised how much battery it saves you. Finally, there may be some apps that are draining your battery life without you even realizing it. So to find out what those apps are and to get a sense of your battery usage in general, go to settings, then battery, and here you'll have a list of apps and services that are using your battery with the top two almost always being your screen and of course, Wi-Fi. So there you have it. Hopefully those tips will help you get a little bit more mileage out of your Android phone.